Alistair Dick and I'm General Manager here at Gold Coast Marine Aquaculture or um, Gold Coast Tiger Prawns. And of course with compliance you're really only looking at the um, you know the really high risk end of the profile and you're not really looking at a broad spectrum of pathogens so you know really more recently and particularly with the involvement of Genix he's moved way beyond just compliance testing into a kind of realm of looking at a broad spectrum of, of uh, pathogens. We think it's a great help and you know there's certainly um, some cost savings involved when we look at things um, in a broader perspective in the past we're very much constrained by cost and um, as I said on Mel's LinkedIn feed it's quite often the pathogen you're not looking for that's the problem and it's usually the cost constraint that stops you from doing the full suite whereas with shrimp multipath we've got a platform where we can do all of those things some of the things we might expect to find from time to time but maybe at elevated levels so they actually give us a management tool the translocation testing stuff we're not allowed to live with uh, exotic pathogens some of the endemic ones we can't live with but some we can so we've got a broad broad um, perspective on on the you know the whole suite of uh, pathogens and really up till now there's not really been a technology that you can do that in a cost-effective manner the, um, we, we have a number of KPIs in our business, so you know, if you really want to get the highest returns, the highest gross margins, then the first issue is always to make your animals survive. A pathogen in your breeding program, you don't tend to easily get rid of it. So the more you screen for, then uh, the more chances you've got of keeping that stock clean. Useful for us because we really want all of our information in a format that I can ask a number of people within our business to interpret. So the interpretation of data and the presentation of data is a very important facet to managing uh, these things. And so we've worked with uh, Mel to come up with a format that we can uh, not only satisfy the government and the agencies um, of the credibility of the data, but also that we can pass it around to various people within our organisation and they can understand what that means.